Warm greetings at the U.S. State Department on Monday for Qatar's foreign minister. Well, I want to welcome Foreign Minister Althani from Qatar to the State Department again. He's a frequent visitor, but he's always welcome. We have a number of important things to discuss, obviously, so please, he's here. Thank you. Thank you. At the top of the list, the Saudi-led political and economic blockade of Qatar, now in its sixth month. Earlier on Monday, Mohammed bin Abdulrahman Al Thani told an audience the blockade is affecting his country's ability to sell its oil and natural gas overseas. But Al Thani also said the bigger problem is this. By launching the blockade, the Saudis, the Emiratis, the Bahrainis and the Egyptians have made the Middle East more unstable. Regional players are acting irresponsibly, taking political gamble with the lives of other nation citizens with no exit strategy. The Qatari's argument is simple. The blockade simply isn't the result of a spat between them and the Saudis, and the U.S. should be worried. But it's not clear whether this new argument will be enough to spur Washington to put more pressure on both sides to resolve the crisis. Rosalind Jordan, Al Jazeera, at the State Department.